Um, now that we have our home page completed with our top three reviews, we need to go ahead and add in some affiliate links. Now if you're um, doing the Amazon, which I'm doing on mine and I would recommend, um, I'll show you how to simply do that. Um, if you're using a different affiliate program, you know it's pretty much the same, just getting an affiliate link and popping it in. So if you're going to do Amazon, if you just go to Amazon's home page, scroll all the way down to the bottom, you can see down here it says make money with us. So if you just click on become an affiliate, you can go ahead and um, basically you know sign up for their program just enter in all your details and you'll be able to create an account now I'm gonna jump over to my account here and the way to get your affiliate links once you've logged in is just go to links and banners and do product links because we want to link to an exact product so I'm gonna go back to my site here let me shrink that down a little and my first product is the Coleman Northridge Zero Mummy Bag. So I'm just going to copy that, head back over to Amazon here, and I'm going to search for that product. Um, and you can see there it is, the Coleman Northridge Zero Degree Mummy Bag. Let me slide this over. So now if I just hit Get Link, And now we will have um, several options here to get our affiliate link. Now the way I like to um, set this up is I use three different links. I'll use an image only, I'll use a text only, and I'll also use a text and image. So I'm going to get the image only first because you know with any review it's nice to have an image of the product. So I just have the image here. And I'm just going to copy the affiliate code they give us. And I'm going to go back to the page here. Let me slide this over. And what we need to do is click up here and we need to go to HTML because we're going to be entering in a code. Now what I want to look for is the best extreme weather bag. So that's my heading on that category. I'm just going to hit enter to put in a space. And I'm just going to paste in the code um, for the image. So now I have an image. I'm going to go back over to Amazon here. Now I'm going to get the text only. So you see it's just a simple text link. I just hit text only. I'm going to copy that. Head back over. And now uh, directly after the image tag I will now paste in the text link. And I'm going to go back to Amazon. Now I'm going to get the text and image. And this has a nice little um, gives them the name, the price, has an image, and also a buy now from Amazon. So again, that's the text and image. I am going to copy that. And now I'm going to put that at the end of my review. So right after the conclusion. So I'll hit enter, paste that in, hit enter again. And now I will update that and we can take a look at what that looks like. Let me refresh the page. So you can see now we have best extreme weather sleeping bag. We have an image and if I click that image, it'll go to Amazon to buy that product and it'll be my affiliate link. I also have a link of it. And you know, a lot of people will click this thinking they're gonna go get more information on it on my site and it's actually gonna take them to the actual listing and give them more information. So, you know, it's nice to have the actual text link there because that'll get clicked a lot. And then you can see we have our review, our conclusion where we basically say it's a great sleeping bag you know, ideal for temperatures down to zero degrees. And then they have a nice link to go purchase it. So if they like our review and they want to buy that one, they have the link there to go ahead and purchase it. Um, and remember, anything they purchase, whether they purchase this sleeping bag or another one, we just basically want them to get it, click a link, get to Amazon, and then buy pretty much anything. So I will go in and add all three of those, and then we'll see what it looks like. So again, I'm just basically going to repeat the process, and I'm going to go Coleman Green Sleeping Bag. Uh, go back to Amazon here. Uh, if I scroll up to the top, I can just do go back to the product link page. Paste that in, hit go. 
and there is my Coleman sleeping bag. And you can see it gives a sales rank. This one's actually in here twice, probably because another company is also selling it. Uh, let me click on this. And you can see this one ships from Amazon. Now, in some cases, you'll get a higher commission percentage if they buy it directly from Amazon. I'm guessing if I click this other one, um, that is sold by the Great Outdoors Depot. So it's not actually sold from Amazon. Um, some products, Amazon just doesn't sell themselves, so you'll have to do it that way. Um, but again, I usually go with the one with the highest sales rank, and that's the one sold by Amazon. So again, I would just get link, get the image, and repeat the process. So let me fill those in quick. You don't need to, I don't need to bore you watching that. Okay, so I've just gone in and filled in all the affiliate links. You can see what it looks like now. We have the best extreme one. We have an image, a link, and the little buy button. Um, same for the cool weather one, and then also the best compact. Now, if you look at the best compact, um, see how the actual link ran on so long? I can actually change that if I want, if you run into this problem. From inside here, um, when I do my text only link, and you see the link text here, I can actually um, modify that to anything I want. So uh, you know, that's pretty long. Maybe I'll just take out um, take out the adventurer just so the link isn't so long. You see that'll actually um, update it. So I'll just copy that. Go back to the edit page. And I'll just edit that out. And now after I refresh the page, you can see it shortened it up so it fits all on one line. Now, one thing you will kind of notice is they all kind of run together. You can see it just goes from one to the next. We can put some space in there to kind of separate each review. Um, I kind of just like to do that to make it easier to read. So an easy way to do that is if I come in here and you see here's the conclusion and then the link. So that's where the first one ends. If I just enter, I'll just hit enter. If I hit put a little HR um, tag in there, it'll actually put a line in there, which will give it a nice little separation. You don't have to do this. Um, just something I personally like to do just to kind of separate each review. Um, so it's a little easier for um, our potential viewers to kind of read. And then I'll just update that. And then we'll take a look at what that looks like. So now if you see at the end of each one, we have a line kind of signifying the end of that product. Then we have the next one and another line. It just kind of separates them out. It makes it a little easier to read, not something you have to do. Um, just a little something I like to add in there. Um, so with that, your home page is done. You can see we have a nice, very nice looking home page. We have the best sleeping bag reviews. Then I go in to review the top, top three choices based on camping conditions because that's how I rated them. So we have the best extreme, the best cold weather, and the best compact sleeping bag. So there, that's going to be our money page. That's where we're going to try to get you know most of our affiliate commissions from. So you want that to look real nice, easy to read. Uh, we have nice little images, buy buttons, hyperlinks. Um, so go ahead and add in your own Amazon affiliate links. Uh, this is the same process we're going to use when we make our post pages as well. Um, so go ahead and finish that up, and then we can move on to the next video.